What's up, true crime fans? Do I got a pick for you today from Priority Mail, from Supernaut True Crime Memorabilia website? Let's open it up, see what we got. Making sure there's nothing in there, nothing else. <clears throat> okay, check it out, guys. I told you you're going to be impressed with this. If you're a true, a real true crime fan slash horror fan, this is kind of a crossover deal here. You're going. This is going to uh, pique your interest. So, as you can probably hopefully see in there there's a uh, Polaroid of a couple standing there some of you might know who that is some of you might not but that's Ronald DeFeo who's Ronald DeFeo Ronald Butch DeFeo he's the uh, he's the murderer that murdered his family back in the uh, late 70s which uh, made the um, brought on the uh, Amneville horror movies that's him right there and that's his wife um, these from what I'm told um, you know the dealer that I bought this from hasn't seen uh, Polaroids from DeFeo uh, come about and he's been in the business for over 25 years so this is very rare indeed and then on the back here as you can see, is a signature by Ronnie DeFeo and a DIN number. It says Green Haven Photo. So, this is basically the uh, photo receipt for the uh, Polaroid. Now, I don't know for sure, but I'm guessing that the dealer obtained this Polaroid and the receipt with Ronnie Ronnie DeFeo's signature from uh, Ronnie's wife here in the picture. I think she uh, probably sold a lot of uh, merchandise over to uh, the dealer and then I got it from the dealer. So my game plan, guys, is to essentially frame the Polaroid and the receipt with a um, maybe like a um, uh, photo of the Amneville the original Amneville Horror House you know, a black and white photo I don't know about that size and put it on uh, have it professionally framed in an 8x10 type frame. So I'll have that up top. This is my idea. Have that up top, the house, and then the Polaroid and the signature receipt on the other side. How badass would that be? Alright, well, that's all I have for you for right now. Um, only you true real true crime fans will understand what having a Polaroid of Ronnie DeFeo and a signature receipt really is um, it's one of the uh, I'd say it's pretty much it's it's like I said earlier in the video it's also like a crossover to the uh, horror genre because look at all the uh, movies the conjuring the Amityville horror all the different movies that were made and remakes this guy started it all. Alright. That's it. That's all I got for you for right now. See you next time.